Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Everyone's been asking for hair tutorials, so here you go. Hair and Elle and I are gonna show you three easy summer hairstyles to get on her curly hair and my kind of wavy hair. Stay tuned, get ready. This is gonna be super fun. I'm gonna use a Dyson Supersonic and some of my favorite wave products. All right, so I'm gonna start by using some Way Wave Spray. And I basically use this on every client before I do any blowout, just to give a little bit of body. It doesn't have any alcohol in it, so it's never going to dry your hair out. And like I said, my hair is naturally wavy. It's not as like cute wavy. It kind of doesn't have consistency in it. So I'm gonna show you guys my quick way, no pun intended, of getting my waves, no pun intended. So I'll start off by showing you guys the clip trick. So you might've seen this on Way's Instagram account before. But what I do is I kind of space the hair and push it up and put it in the clip so that I'm creating a wave in the hair. And I like to leave the very, very ends out on my lob just so that it looks nice and straight on the bottom and not too bent in because I don't want it to look like a mom bob or like soccer mom hair. No offense to soccer moms. So I can either use my smoothing nozzle or the styling concentrator. And if you can see the airflow is super concentrated here. So I probably use that if I am doing my hair like, if I'm doing like a really nice big like 90s blowout, I'm actually gonna use this. And I'm gonna do medium airflow and medium heat. Okay, so it's been about, I'd say five to seven minutes. I was just kind of rough drying over the clips. And this is what I do when I do not have time or if I'm on vacation and I just don't want to take a lot of time for my hair. So now I'm just gonna take those clips out and kind of just shake through the hair. And you can see, voila, like cute beachy waves. And then I'll show you another alternative to that. Again, spraying your way wave spray. And this is what I call the accordion trick. And you guys, it's so, so easy for you to do. I'm gonna switch from the smoothing nozzle to the styling concentrator. I could use a diffuser, but I wanna kinda of show you guys the way that like, if I'm really in a rush, I need that airflow to be super concentrated. So now I'm just gonna take sections of my hair. And you can do this on medium and long hair as well. You're gonna keep that very end out and you're just gonna fold back and forth in your hand. So if you can see, I've just got it folded there. The hair is literally like an accordion, which is like back and forth. I think like a pasta noodle. Um, I'm not squeezing. I'm literally just like kind of like holding the hair and I'm gonna take, my airflow is gonna be on medium and my heat is gonna be on medium. If you had like really like fragile thin hair, I would say like maybe don't go as hot. You could go on low heat and medium airflow. All right, taking my next section. And I'm just gonna do the accordion trick, folding back and forth. So I'm staying about two inches off of the root. All right guys, so you can kind of see that wave that's coming in here. Now it's been about two minutes. And honestly, if I'm really in a rush, I just rough dry the very bottom part. But an alternative is if you want it to feel a little fuller, if you have fine hair, clip the top section off and you can take the bottom and do the same thing. Just using my Dyson Supersonic and some Way Wave Spray and a few duckbill clips. You can find these at like your local drugstore. And there you have it. So this is my clip trick waves and this is my accordion trick waves. Now if you have really thick hair and you want to kind of break it up a little bit, use a tiny bit of Way Matte Pomade. The reason why I love this and the reason we made it is because I like it to look like your hair is PC and broken up, but it doesn't look like you have a ton of product in your hair. I like to kind of just shake it through the curls to give it that really nice PC, cool beachy look. Good luck you guys, and if you remake this look on yourself, make sure you tag me. Hey guys, it's Irenelle here, and I'm gonna show you guys one of my go-to summer hairstyles on my curly hair using one of my favorite weight products in addition to how to use the Dyson Supersonic with the diffuser attachment. So let's get started. Okay, so first I'm gonna use the Way Curl Jelly on my hair. Start with four pumps. Seems like a lot, but I don't like to apply too much product on my hair when it's curly, um, just because I feel like that weighs it down. So I'm not even gonna part my hair either. So you can just go through and 
with your fingers and just rake through the product. The Curl Jelly is great just because it's super lightweight, it's very hydrating, it defines your curls, and it's also great um, just to let your hair air dry as well. One tip for girls with very curly hair is to reduce the amount of frizz that you have when diffusing or air drying. You always wanna make sure that your hair is pretty wet, more so on the wet side than damp, because that's just gonna ensure that you get very frizz-free curls. So as you can see, I'm just spraying through my head with a little bit of water to make sure that, you wanna make sure that the slip is good and it's enough. And you also wanna hear it scrunching. It's kind of like ASMR, but if you hear it scrunching, then that's a good thing. It means that you're ready to diffuse. And I just like going through my hands and just scrunching because it starts to mold the curl. And I also stay away from putting products on my roots. The more product you put on your roots, the more it's gonna weigh it down. So I stayed away from here because I kind of want it to be voluminous and you know just have a nice shape to it so I stay away from that so we're gonna do low speed and medium heat you want low speed because you don't want the hair to blow around everywhere you really want to make sure that the curly hair is being dried very slowly because that reduces the amount of frizz and we're just gonna start from the bottom and just tilt to the side and you're gonna hold for a few seconds before you move around the head. You wanna make sure you're following a nice consistent motion and not moving the dryer around too much because that can just create frizz that you probably don't want. One thing I love about the Dyson is that it's extremely light, so your arms never get tired. I feel like a lot of girls, it's really hard for women to do their hair a lot of the times because it feels like you've done 50 push-ups. So as you start getting to the side of your head, you're gonna wanna tilt a bit more, just so it dries with the body on both sides of your head. For the girls that want extra volume and body up top, what you're gonna do is flip your head upside down and diffuse that way for a few seconds just to make sure you're getting the most body possible. Okay guys, so here's my summer hairstyle. It's my go-to. And with the Dyson diffuser, it's great just because it speeds up the time. It's designed to disperse the air evenly. It reduces frizz and I can't go one day without using it. So I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope you guys learned something. If you guys want to follow me, my Instagram handle is at hairanel and I hope to see you guys soon. So first up is the new gentle air attachment. So this is gonna be for anyone who feels like the temperature and the speed of the supersonic is a little harsh on their sensitive scalp. What's amazing about the air attachment, it delivers really gentle styling. Again, it's for people with fine hair or really sensitive scalps. Okay guys, so the features on the gentle air attachment, it operates at a lower temperature so it can help prevent color loss. It's 68% cooler with four times amplified airflow to give you like fast drying and it enables high heat and airflow mode, so it will do faster drying for people with sensitive scalps. It diffuses the air and it makes it gentler and cooler on the scalp. And the best part is, you guys, it's compatible with any of the older generations of the Dyson Supersonic hair dryer. So no matter what one you have, it'll fit. 
So the Y2 Calm Attachment is engineered for curly and textured hair, and it detangles, it strengthens, and it lengthens the hair as it dries. And if you look closely, the teeth are tapered and rounded at the end so that it's super comfortable on the scalp, and it's compatible with any of the generation Dyson Supersonic hair dryers that you have. All right guys, thanks for watching. Make sure that you like and subscribe if you wanna see more tutorials like this. Let me know, make sure you follow me and Addix because we're gonna be doing so many fun tutorials for you guys. And I have a ton of friends and assistants with different hair types. So let me know in the comment section below what kind of hair you have and what tutorial you wanna see and we'll get popping. Thanks for watching.